Hey guys, um, I said I was gonna make a video every Monday, well, 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 but I said I was gonna make a video every Mondays, and, um, Fridays, probably gonna be able to do on Wednesdays, because it was kind of some sad news, and I'm pretty sad about it, but I think it would be better off. I had to give away my dog, and I gave her away, um, yesterday. And it was a pretty big sad thing, but I think it was for the best. I mean, she's better off there. Also, um, I'll be able to make frequent, more frequent videos for you guys. Um, first thing I want to talk about is well, that. Second thing I want to talk about is I had many drawings, right? Um, I think you guys saw the Naruto one. I'm pretty sure you did, but you guys didn't see the Goku one that did a Super Saiyan, him turning into a Super Saiyan. We're not turning into the him actually is a super saiyan so whatever i'll show you guys that later but for now we're gonna we're gonna do an origami tutorial guys i've been waiting to get a tutorial about origami for quite a while it's both on yashimoto um origami i'm gonna find the right owner to this so um just give me a sec i'm sorry my head is not there right now um Um, so I'm pretty, um, sad about what I just told you guys. It's, um, the, the person that has created the tutorial that I watched, and, well, I'm giving her, you know, you know. So, um, yeah, I got two friends. Well, this is not mine. Okay. So, the designer is Nakoroto Nigata. And her name is Happy Puppy, wait, Happy Puppy Truffle. Okay, that's everything, so, no, nothing. Um, so this is what the box looks like, what I made. And I'm just going to make one more, just to show you guys the tutorial on how to make it. Just this one more. So this is, this is the first one, so it's closed off and I put tape. Okay, these are the colors. This is, um, dark blue, forest green, gray. Uh, turquoise, this one's turquoise, and then this one is just a baby blue. Um, also, excuse me, if you guys look in there, you can see, whoa, okay, you guys can see all this stuff. I bought this stuff, um, for drawing, guys, okay? so, see, this one is just red, you know, just basic colors and stuff like that. I think it's pretty cool for you guys. You guys got light, more light. Oh yeah, it's on the So now we're just gonna we already did dark blue. So now I'm gonna pick a color that should go with this. I think a little red will be good. I'm not gonna um put the uh, tape it. So first off, get your origami paper. This is um six by six inches, six inches by six inches. Um yeah, I'm put it so it's the color side facing down. If you have printed paper, it doesn't matter. Whatever. You're gonna fold it. I'm trying to see if I can see better. But I'm just gonna fold it in half this. My camera can focus. Um, but I, I promised you guys a video today, and I'm doing a video. This video is gonna kind of be long. Let me just show you guys what I'm gonna do in a sec, because I need to get a better view. So, I don't know if you guys would be able to see them, just now, but, oh, it is on. So, I'm just going to, every now and then, just to say this, so it's a cross, basically, but this way. So now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this side, right? Okay, there. I'm going to take this side, and I'll put it on the line that I made, okay? Now, some people like to just bring up the other side. I can't do it like that. I have to open this, flip it, and then bring this side up to the middle line. doesn't matter which one you do first, as long as you have the most. Now, you have one, two, three, four big lines, which are cut in half, so it's like eight. So, so now you're going to take it, fold it the other way. See, we fold it this way. Now, you're going to take it, flip it, and 
die first. Well, not first, but definitely. But sorry. Okay. We're gonna flip it over, open this, and get this. I'm gonna be doing more origami tutorials, but I'm gonna also do more drawing tutorials and um send me those requests. I mean, no one knows. Send me some requests. Um, so we have 16 boxes now. Actually, open it. Be four times four, 16. So now I'm gonna take it. We're gonna open it. I'm gonna take this and fold it right here. I'm sorry if you guys can't see this because the quality is kind of a little bad. But yeah, just take it and fold it. You see how like there's like two lines right here. You see how this is like one big square. You're just gonna take it and fold it right on this line, okay? I'm going to try to get a better camera, guys. I don't know, but I'm going to try. So now, we have this, and we should take, again, fold it like this on that line I just showed you guys right now. So I'm going to do it this way. I can't do it, you know. There's certain ways I have to do origami, guys, because sometimes, like, I can't really do it well. So, um, just fold them all so you get, like, there's like two, there's actually, actually two, four, six, eight, um, little lines around this box. So now I'm gonna take one corner and fold it all the way up to right there, guys. Not up, not up to here, not up to here, right there. You see the square on the top of this square right there? Sorry about my nails, guys. Really sorry about that. Just to have, I don't know, I'll bite them. So you're going to do it again, right here. My camera, my, my phone camera is not focusing well, and I don't know what's going on with it. it it's charging right now, too, so, so I could have some time. We closed that one already. Oh, sorry, I'll bite. And it's like five. Actually, wait. I will do a time. It's 6.04, and it's mad bright. Guys, like no kidding. You're gonna do this to all four sides. Um, open them and make sure you guys look good. Okay. So now, um, we're gonna you see the center marking right here, right there. We're going to take this corner, all the corners, and put it on the center marking, like so. You guys can see it, but not that much, so I'm going to fix it later on. So you're going to take all of them, and you're just going to... I have my grape sitting right next to me, and I haven't even touched... Well, I touched the one, and I ate it. Yeah, so I kinda, maybe you guys heard chewing, I'm not sure about that. But I don't like to do it like this, where I have to do all the triangles then. I like to, like, do the triangle, put it to center, then do the line right here, the little baby line. So, you, you see this line that we did to put it up there? See that? And the little line here, we open it this line. Well, you're going to take this little corner and put it right there on that triangle. Okay. Right there on those, like, see those two little triangles? You're going to put it right up there. Okay. I would really appreciate if you guys, like, you're going to do it for all four of them. I would appreciate if you guys would actually send me some requests. I'm just doing these because, well, I don't know, I'm kind of bored. And, well, obviously I'm going to teach you how to set it up, like, how to put it on. You couldn't tape it if you want. I taped it because I don't want to want to, like, mess it up. This is what you should get. And you're just going to fold all of It gets the better quality when you go up. Broken down, like broke it so much. So now you're gonna take these and you're gonna fold these. Remember what we did? You're just gonna make them better, like crease them with whatever you have near you. A pencil would be the best option to crease it with if you have a pencil like in your drawer. Like this is my desk for drawing and stuff like that. I see paint and stuff like that. But anyway, so now take this and then there's a little diamond in there. See that thing? Which is basically like covering it like we did before we, we folded these. Then I'm going to open these two and you're going to take these two, open them and bring them back. But have these, have this out pointing out like that. So now we're just going to, I want to see you guys to see it. 
Okay, so we have this little painting. We don't squish it in the inside. We actually squish it to the left. I actually made five, and this is like my sixth one. So I'm pretty like my back was like hurting because I wasn't sitting on this chair. And I take this, smush it on the corner right here. In the corner you have to smush it before you put it down because now it's gonna get messed up. Okay, do good creases. I don't know if you guys can hear any noise in the background, like music or something. It's just, just don't pay attention to that. Maybe it might be good music you might be hearing, I don't know. I, I really hear, like, I hear very little, but I have a fan, like, right in my ear, too, so I don't know if you guys will be able to hear it. But kind of like a little, um, what's that called? A uh, pinwheel? Um, so yeah, flip it over. Sorry about that. Don't pay attention, just listen to what I'm saying and do the tutorial. So, um, um, you see this? Okay. This, you're gonna go like this. There's one triangle here, there's one right here. This one we want. This one has a line on it, alright? So, we're gonna take this and we're gonna put the creases around it. So, I don't know what kind of fold is that. And then we're just gonna fold it back and pinch pinch this all the time. When you pinch this it makes it better. So now we're gonna find it again. So you're gonna take it. It's fairly in the middle. See this one right here? I'm gonna take this and you're gonna fold it like this. I'm gonna take this one and you're gonna fold it the same way. I'm actually looking at the camera while doing this. Whoa, whoa. Okay, so you're gonna take this and you fold them and they'll come together. Just fold them together and then pinch. Now do the same for the other one. Fold on these two sides, pinch. Go, go. Fold on these two sides and pinch. You don't want to pinch the one like this. It doesn't have a line on it. You can see it doesn't have no lines on it. So now it kind of looks like it looks cute though. I should have made like something like this, but no. Flip it over. It was like way too much blowy, but. So now we're going to take this one, we're going to start for this one first, unopen it, unflap this flap, we're going to unflap all of them actually, unflap all of them, and we're going to well, just squeeze the three, it doesn't matter what you do guys, it doesn't really matter, because we're going to, it's going to come out pretty basically. So now we're going to take this, pop it, this, remember the triangle that we folded, pop it open like this. Okay, so now this is going to kind of get tricky. You want to pop this diamond out so it's popped out fairly well. And then you're going to take this and you're going to um, see this little L shape right here? And you want to fold this onto the L shape. Just don't crease it here, don't. Okay, so now I'm going to take this and it's going to want to fold on the inside. It's going to want to go something like. I want to do something like, um, this thing always plays with me. Something like this, is what I want to do. Um, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Boy. Okay, I got it. So it's going with something like this. So what I did was I just take this, fold it like this, and then this should come out. Well, it's going to fold like this, but you just want to press down right here, like on the middle part right here, and then put this down, and then it's going to want to make like a, a V shape. So now I'm going to take this and make sure that these are lined up. I'm trying to get as close to the camera as possible, and then just flatten it out. Because I want you guys to catch all of this. Well, what you're going to do too is you can crease that in half, which is what you want to do. So make sure you don't want to mess with that, just go to the other side. It was kind of hard for me the first time because I had no idea what what the tutorial person was saying. It was kind of like it was flying over my head. But then I kind of get it, you know, like it, it makes perfect sense now. So see it's coming up like a box, we just need to do these two sides. So, whoa. so we don't want to mess this one up, I almost did. So now we're just going to take this, pop this out. Make sure that you pop, you put your fingers like 
like right here on this crease line like that. And then just fold it. Take it and then put it like this and like that. Kind of like this. Fold it like this. Like, this. like Okay, okay, okay. So you guys are probably not gonna get it either. Probably, you guys are probably are like, I don't get this. So let me just go back a little bit. You're gonna take this. Okay, so you can see this little L shape here. You're gonna wanna, you're gonna wanna push this like this, but not really all the way. Then you're gonna kind of like try folding it this way, and it should actually fairly fit in. It's gonna wanna actually go inside, and we're just gonna do one more side. Okay, so it's like this, right? And take your fingers, and you're gonna basically just pop it out like that, flatten it, okay? Flatten it like so. Take this and pop it out. If you guys, um, if you guys send me some tutorials, like if you guys want me to make something, and you guys are saying like put dotted lines on it, I'll be happy to put dotted lines. You guys think put like a little mark on where? So you're gonna take this, fold it this way. See mine mine I didn't even crease it. Fold it like this and it goes in. I actually did five and I started getting the hang of it. That's when I wanted to do this tutorial video. I actually wanted to do a bookmark and be like, oh you guys caught me right in the middle of me doing a bookmark. But it wasn't gonna work because it was just getting me mad and I just crushed it. Yeah. So now you're gonna take all these, just fold them like this. So you see the bottom is kind of like all this weird thing. I'm just going to take like this. You see like a little like line right here. And you're just going to fold them. Like so. Uh, probably tomorrow I'm going to do a drawing update again. So it's going to be like this. So this is like probably one of the longest I've ever done of videos. So she looks something like this and it should stand. Well, my fan's blowing it away. So now we're going to bring this in. Well, you probably, you can make two, three, four, I'd do five. So beautiful different colors. And as you can see, it's really used to actually keep it balanced. This is painter's um, masking tape. Black duct tape, yellow duct tape, white oak, red, and black. And then, again, I showed you on the inside, is all the colors that I bought, except I didn't buy that Sharpie right here. I was real. I didn't buy this black Sharpie, and I, and I didn't buy that one. I actually had them here. Okay, so then I'm bringing this in, right? And, and if you have, like, obviously if you make these, you're going to have, like, these flaps right here. If you did it all in white, you have these flaps right here. And then you have these flaps. So what you're going to do is you're going to take this. Like, you're going to take one, one, and take another one. Put it like this. Mug. So it fits like this. But then you're like, um, I'm not going to leave it like that. So you're just going to put these put these inside the hole, this right here, and you should be good to go. And then just tape them on both sides. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. Bye.